how are you all i hope that you are doing amazing yes it's time to talk about nhc college right here in bangalore near to belandur so all the people over there can be really happy about it now yes it is top 17th college and we have few very official data over here that is about the highest package it was 32.5 for domestic that is for indian recruiters and over here average package was 6.5 lp again for domestic recruiters now you might be thinking all of a sudden why is ma'am talking about uh, domestic and international and everything like that because they have put up their data for them separately so we thought of putting that for you as well so you also get a clear cut idea of it now placement rate it is not official okay it is not an official letter it was 85.6 percent which is why i'm not stressing too much into it okay so this is the data that you can probably trust yeah and now we'll move on we'll see everything detail now overview of the college is the first thing the name of the college is new horizon college of engineering with love nhce we go ahead we talk about the year of, year of establishment 2001 location bangalore affiliation it is affiliated to vishveshwaraya technological university very good university you can trust it talking about the placement record which is something very important so i've got so much data about this particular college and I was really glad about it. I'll tell you why. Okay. So the highest CTC 32.5 LPA. They didn't mention the year. But uh, we are kind of sure that it is for 2024 itself. Because from other unofficial website also they were showing something similar. Okay. And uh, obviously the colleges they, uh, they change their data like every year most probably for more amount of uh, admissions as well. So yes that is the rate. Now number of offers made. In the year 2023 was 1326 but according to what I saw I can include like number of offers were made were this much but it could also include mtech and other courses so which is why I calculated this with the list that they have provided I will tell you about all about that but yes you can go with this particular range that is 11802 1326 I will show you how I did calculate now we go ahead placement rate if you talk as i said it is unofficial but yeah it is 85.6 percent let's talk about some official data here now so i told you about a list right so there's one very good thing that i liked about the college which is they provide a whole list of candidates that is with the names which course they did and uh, were they getting placed and in which company they got placed so all the data is there in their official website if you go to the placement tab now from there i found this data that might be really helpful for you so i thought i'll make a ppt out of it now for cac 382 offers were came, coming one uh, iac it is uh, 269 ece 253 e triple e it is 99 mech it is a mechanical engineer it is 102 au it's not there now okay for at least by the seed matrix that we found it was not there it was automobile engineering i didn't find the seat for this particular course so i didn't put it there so anyways it was there 49 and cv civil engineering is basically 6 26 so basically these many numbers are there number of offers are there and if you add it up it comes out to be 1180 that i was talking earlier right so that is the reason how why i put it now over here you might be able to see that the highest number of offers were backed by cse that is computer science and engineering then comes isc that is information science and engineering then comes ece which is uh, uh, electronics and communication engineering okay later comes mechanical and then comes triple e then comes uh, your automobile engineering even though that course is still there in their official website but in the seat matrix we could not find it okay now cv 26 so that's all that's the official data we go ahead we talk more about it i definitely have uh, something else also to add up so the highest package this is how they mentioned okay the highest package for domestic placement was 32.5 lp domestic means as in in india itself okay highest package for international placement it was rupees 35 lpa so we are over here that's why i put this in the initial slide okay we go ahead average package for domestic placement was 6.5 lpa for international placement it was the average package was rupees 30 lpa okay few more data for you guys so in the year 2022 this was the uh, okay so there were names of the children also 
this is for international placement that was that was happening in the year 2022 22 okay so over here uh, you can see the courses where in which company they got placed and what was the package offered so i saw that uh, basically 20 uh, this ece as well as cse and isc all of them uh, the children they got placed over here and they have getting a salary in a range that is 28 to 30 lpa in the year 2022 so i thought it could help you because you're talking about international placements right so this com this college offers international placement as well and probably uh, they are choosing more children from these courses so we never know there are three different courses and over here also you have other courses so just exclude the mca rest everything is yours okay now that's all let's go ahead let's talk about the nirf ranking it is uh, it came in the bandwidth of 151 to 200 which is not bad okay it's okay it's good national assessment and accreditation uh, the grade was a grade the highest is a plus plus over here they have a the lowest is c so it's also good not bad now mode of admission we have case it we do not have comet k fees if you talk about the fees for case it as uh, it was published in the official uh, karnataka website what was the fees it is rupees 1,7495. now this is the provisional fee it can change as well so if you have not watched this video you can watch it because ma'am will be explaining about uh, the fee structure and everything which was published by the karnataka government itself so if you want you can see the video if you want to have more clarity regarding it okay so let's move ahead to the courses that are being offered by this particular college are you excited i am excited so these are the courses that we have over here and what is the college code for getting into these courses we have e099 do not mess up with the college code it will mess up your life for some time so yes so we have these many courses then we have seats then we have the case it cut off for 2023 now what do you mean by seats that is the number of seats available for this particular course this is of the year 2024 right so electrical and electronics engineering has 120 seats that means 120 children can get admission for this particular course the same thing goes for all the other courses that you see over here now what do we have we have case it rank the cutoff rank and let's see which has the highest and the lowest cutoff rank so the highest cutoff rank is for computer science and engineering that is 9034 9034 why do i call it highest because my rank should be below this that's when i can get admission for this particular course which is why i call it the highest cutoff rank okay now what is the lowest cutoff rank something that will be really easy for me to get in right not very easy but yeah comparatively so that is for mechanical engineering what is the cutoff 1,24,220 so if my rank comes in this range below this range obviously I can get admission for mechanical engineering so that is the highest and this is the lowest cutoff now imagine a scenario where you are not bothered about the college you want to get into this college for any random course okay because of so many other reasons okay now what should your rank range lie in between so basically if it's for case set, the highest rank cutoff rank will be here, the lowest will be here. Your rank should be in between this so that whatever rank it justifies, it can come under whatever course it is applicable for. Okay, for example, my rank is 50,000. Then probably I can get admission for this one. Because here, the highest cutoff value is what? 55,877. And what's my rank? 50,000. So I can get into this particular course. So, is this a general way that you should be finding out like how, which course you should be choosing? No, you should have a clear cut idea of what course and what are you doing, going to do with your life. Okay, very pre-planned should be. So, have your order of preferences that you want from one particular college. You can have two preferences or three preferences for the courses that you want. But it should be something that is of use for you in the future. Think about the future. Okay, so that's all. Let's move ahead. We go ahead, we talk about the facilities provided. The hostel facility is there for both girls and boys. Transport facilities are also provided by this particular college that is New Horizon. Now, since I did not find 
the uh, the fees and you always ask me the fees so i thought so usually i comment down the contact detail or anything so over here i got the contact details for uh, different different blocks that is hostel blocks that you have over here you can just call them and inquire about the fees because it was not there in the official website so this is the maximum that i could do for you okay so this is the thing that i have you can give a call if you want you can just uh, move aside so if you if you're not able to see clearly you can see it clearly take a screenshot of it okay so yes that's all are you still finding it difficult to find all the information about your dream college then we are here to help you out we'll definitely help you out in ways possible that uh, like how whatever we can we'll definitely do it for sure so do not forget to comment down your doubts if possible we'll definitely clear it yeah and if you have not seen these videos and if you think that it is useful for you you can definitely go and give a watch as well okay wherever you have confusion you can go watch the video if you do not have any confusion in any videos do not watch it no issues okay do not waste your time on anything that you are not sure of so that's all so if you like this video if you think it was useful for you then definitely do not forget to like share and subscribe I hope that this video is really helpful for you and I hope that you are not forgetting to smile often. So bye bye, take care.